so while it's recording, I can't hear it on my headphones. So I'll have to use the laptop speakers. Anyway, yeah, so hello, this is Sibby Studio Tour. This is the third fucking time I'm doing it. The first time I did it, I did a video and I didn't save the video. <laughs> For fuck's sake. And then I closed the app. Um, and the second time we did it, it came out really fucking good. And then there was me talking, me clicking the buttons, but there was no sound. All right, yeah, so hi, my name's Sibby. This is my studio tour. Um, and this is my music software. I have never done a studio tour before because I was like, well, I'm not doing a studio tour because I don't really have a studio. And Mark, that acid cloud daddy, said to me, oh, actually, you do have a studio because you've got it all on there. Um, and yeah, I've got it all on here. I do want an MPC one because they look sick on the video and they look sick to use. Um, I think that's the only hardware I would want because really, if you look at this, it pretty much is all the hardware in the software. Uh, not the same as touching everything, but you know, I can live with it. And plus I have a thing about wires. I can't deal with them, they drive me nuts, so I could only imagine how anxious it would make me having wires all over the place. Oh no. But anyway, I can just look at those wires if I want to look at wires. Yeah. Anyway, so okay. Let's get into it, shall we? Uh right, okay, so first of all, this is one of my main go to drum programmers that I use. Kong is absolute fucking boss. Kong is king. King. Yeah. Um, I'm only hearing it on the laptop speakers, but I'm I'm sure it sounds good. Let's turn it up a bit. Yeah. Laptop fucking speakers. I don't uh, but anyway, yeah. So, screen for distortion. One of my favourite things ever. Take that off. Put it on. Yeah, it's cool as fuck. Um, and there is hundreds and hundreds of kits to go through. And then you open up those and there's more inside. It's just awesome as fuck um, uh, and one of my other favourite drum kits is I'm a big fan of drums if anyone knows me knows is this oomph club drums they are sick raw power uh, uh, it sounds like distortion on it Nice. From what I can fucking hear on these bloody laptop speakers. Mm. Oh, that's nice. I think. Really wish I could plug my headphones in. Uh, but yeah, so that's another thing that I use all the time for my drums. I use the oomph drums mostly for drum and bass, trap and techno kind of music and then I'll use Kong for like more laid back hip hop type beats and stuff. Uh, yeah, so that's that. Uh, trying to be as quick as I can because the first video that I made and I didn't save it, it was like an hour long. <laughs> so I'm trying to be quick now. So when I first started using Reason, I used that. And the reason I used that is because I didn't know how to program drums. And it's there. It sounds shit. There's loads of shit you can do to it to make it sound better. Okay. Let's get rid of that. Um, this is one of my favourite instruments. And I use it in a lot of techno. Wow, 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 wow. 
Like that. All right, so if I stop that in, I'm just going to do a fucking hell. Oof, baby. F is my go to. Alright, let's just get that. Uh, so there's all sorts of shit you can do on it. I, I can't even, I can, can barely get into it really, but. Let's cut that up so I don't want that. these instruments that are on here um, weren't on Reason 10 and because I've upgraded straight from that a lot of them I'm not familiar with and I haven't been delving into them because I wanted to get my set done obviously so I've just used the ones that I know so Europa was used a lot in my set I fucking love Europa um, Grain is oh, the bass you can get out of this is fucking epic
this particular sample and just play with the uh, pause player just for hours, whatever it's called, what's it called? Scales and chords, it's just it's beautiful. Right, anyway, taking too long on that one to be. Okay, I see, yeah, so I've not put anything in here, just whack one of them on a bit and it went off with it. I was using Dr. Octolex because I didn't know how to program drums, but then I copied it to the track and realised, oh, it's actually loads of fun editing drums. Uh, then I discovered this one. It sounds really flat and stuff at first, but you, you just fuck with it. You just fuck with it, have fun with it, learn as you go. So I got to grips with that one, I got bored and then Kong became my baby and now it's this. Subtract is awesome. is definitely not long enough to delve into it and oh I'm so gutted that the 
second video I did didn't record the sound because it actually came up really fucking good. Feeling a little bit deflated, but you know. It's just too much to go through but that's just a little glimpse into the stuff I use and um, yeah I hope that was hope you enjoy it